This looks suspiciously like a concrete block. <laughs> here I'm explaining the difference between what we're trying to do here today, which is cut the thing in half, and what you'd actually do in a fight. As much as we'd love to take credit for this guy, that's Jeremy Steflick of WSTR. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Here the cut is deep and mostly straight, but towards the end I lose control of the sword and it turns. <laughs> oh, very nice. See, her grip is even and it didn't hurt. No kicks! I should have brought gloves. That turn. Watch the flex after that cut. If you don't cut all the way through and the clay falls, that's how you can mess up a sword. Here we're using our crossable Sunway Tinker, which is flexy and hard to cut with. One of the issues with clay is that the clay builds up on the sword, and if you don't clean it off, it becomes very heavy and difficult to stop. Pop like a monkey. Here comes the best cut of the day. And that's why you don't fuck with the red man. As we reform the clay and pat it down, it keeps getting fatter and fatter, which means you're actually cutting through a lot more clay as you go. <laughs> Winter cows are very hard. None of us were able to get all the way through. This is a better way to reform the clay by trimming the edges because they build up as it gets more squat. Oh, shit. Oh, shit.